And you at six, something is crawling on the strip, and it's not just tourists. Guests at one hotel say they woke up to something crawling in their beds. Mm. Contact 13 investigative reporter Stephanie Zeppelin talks with the family attacked by bed bugs and gets the hotel's response. An exciting night on the Vegas Strip turned into a terrible morning. Around 4 a.m., I felt something crawling on my leg and I wasn't sure what it was. So as I got out of bed and turned the lights on, I actually found the bug crawling across the bed. Daniel Adams says he caught these two bed bugs while staying at the Polo Towers on August 24th, 2014. He and his family came out for a birthday celebration. It was a big day. It was a one in a lifetime event. My daughter turns 21 and so this was her present for me to come out here so we all could spend it together and I feel it was ruined. The bugs were disturbing, but what really got Daniel and his mom Pamela upset was how the hotel reacted. They offered to have Daniel move rooms, but would not move the rest of the party in the adjoining room. After they got home, they had their own houses treated for bed bugs, afraid some may have snuck home in the luggage. And Daniel is still dealing with what happened. I have a lot of problems sleeping, uh, anxiety, you know, fear of parasitosis and things like that. Just at times waking up feeling like I have bugs crawling on me. They told me heat will kill them, so I'll run an iron over my bed to make sure. Just little things like that that I've never had to live with before. He and his family hired a lawyer after they said the hotel offered them nothing to make up for their unexpected room guests. They didn't even offer to contact me. They didn't offer me any anything, not even a, I'm sorry. We reached out to Polo Towers parent company Diamond Resorts and they sent us this statement saying that the health and safety of their employees and customers is top priority and that they followed all procedures to get rid of the bed bugs, but they couldn't tell us much else because of the ongoing lawsuit. Stephanie Zeppelin, 13 Action News.